All right, see, what's your uh, your general thoughts and feelings right now about Friday's game, man? No, I'm excited, man. I, I, I'm a little nervous, but, you know, being able to call an NBA game, like, and, you know, I'm such a huge fan. Um, obviously, I'm a big KD fan, so to be able to call a game that he's playing in is going to be a lot of fun. I'm excited. Did you ever – I, I mean, I know – I've talked to you about your childhood and like playing sports a million times, but did you ever like fake announce games as a kid? Like, did you ever find yourself like broadcasting games as a kid? You know what? I never did it as a kid, but like when I played with Aaron Boone, that's what he did. We sat on the bench, like the days that he wasn't playing and I, and I wasn't pitching, we would sit on the bench and like broadcast the game. Like he would be the, 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 uh, the analyst and I would be like the color guy and we would like go and do the game. So you know, I got a little experience with Booney in the dugout. <laughs> it sounds to me like then when the Nets play his Sixers, we might have to bring him back and have you both do the game with us. Absolutely. I would love that. And I'm going to wear full Nets gear and it would just, it would eat him <laughs> up, bro. <laughs> oh, that's so great. Now, like, do you, do you see yourself having any like signature style? Like, do you see yourself being able to come up with like any certain phrases? Like, would you be like a Van Gundy where you're, super harsh on the officials or like a Richard <laughs> Jefferson or Mark Jackson, where you're very, you know, Richard can be controversial and funny. Mark Jackson with his <laughs> sayings, you know, like, do you have anyone in mind? Uh, I don't want to be controversial or controversial at all, but I think <laughs> Richard is funny though. He's funny to listen to. So, you know, hopefully if I can get some comedy in there and keep it light and, you know, just enjoy being a fan. Like for me, I'm a fan, you know what I'm saying? So I can't do anything that these guys can do. So, I just want to enjoy the game and, and be able to talk about it and ask you guys questions. Yeah, we have Sarah to rely upon as well, which is nice. For sure. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that helps a lot. How about, dude, how about just KD and Kyrie? Like, I mean, I know just for me doing the preseason game the other day, I was just blown away with how good they looked. And you're reminded, of course, that in this league in particular, when you get those top five, top ten players, their impact is ridiculous. But – I mean, what are you most looking forward to when it comes to watching those two guys in a Brooklyn uniform this year? I mean, Katie and Kyrie are Katie and Kyrie. They're going to, you know, they're two, two of the best players in the league. You know, I'm excited to see the Joe Harris's and the Karis LeVert's and DeAndre Jordan's. And those are going to be the guys that are, that are going to have to carry this team to the uh, Eastern Conference Championship, you know. So, um, you know, I'm glad Joe Harris got paid. He's going to have to hit some big shots. But, I mean, Katie looked normal. You know what I'm saying? And, and we talked about this, you know, a couple of weeks ago. When he's healthy, he's the best player in the East, period. Well, uh, bro, I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be great, man. And I'm so I'm so pumped for this. And you know what? Let's knock it out of the park, and then let's get you there for a home game sometime at Barclays during the regular season. Hey, I got my suit altered, too, so I'm ready, guys. Let's go. You know what? I'm sure you had to. You probably have to get all your suits altered, right? Man, my, I, it was like double the size, guys. Like you, you. It was insane. I should have took a picture. It was insane how big that suit was. My suits are on me. I, I'm gonna tell you what's gonna happen. You're gonna love the way you look in the suit so much now with your new cut up physique that you're gonna be like, you know what? I want to wear suits to broadcast games. Absolutely not. <laughs> basketball games. I'll broadcast basketball games with a suit on. No baseball oh, games though. Okay. Baseball <laughs> sweats. Basketball suit. Definitely. Fair enough. All right. Well, I can't wait. See, and, and for, for everybody out there, remember our game, 8 o'clock Friday night on Yes, catch CeCe Sabathia's NBA analyst debut.